That's Sam and Joyce here. We're back out in the St. Johns River again. And uh, we set some crab traps. We said actually, we said eight this time. You're allowed five. So we got five and uh, Joyce is with me. She's got three. So we got to see how we do with eight. And we're coming up on our first one now. We set two here in a little different area than we had the other ones. So we'll see how we do. That bait. It was a porgy bait. Porgy bait. Yeah, we were offshore fishing a few days ago, and we used the uh, racks and heads from what we fished for. So we got albacore, porgy, lane snapper. I don't like the porgy bait. Yeah, they might like. Out. They might not like this area. So we'll, we'll go up to our other spot, pick up this other trap. Uh, what the heck? Well, here's our second one. See that's got an R in it. You have to have an R on your trap so they know it's a recreational trap. And also you gotta have your name tag on with your, you need a permit now to crab here in Florida. So you put your permit number. Oh, that's pretty good. Yes, it's better. Yeah, that's a little better. This is lane snapper. Bait. Lane snapper, that's a high price fish. They like the lane snapper. It's not too bad. A couple no. of nice ones in there. Mm -hmm. Six, seven, eight. Eight of them in there. Yeah, that's good. A couple of little ones are throw over, boy. Oh, no, there's nine in here. One back here we didn't see. This is our third trap. We come up on our third trap. Pretty good. Six. Well, we got six. One little guy. This was Albacore. What we got there? Oh, is the Albacore? Yeah. Albacore Alba and Lane Snapper. No, it's Albacore pieces. Oh, there was a lane in there? Yeah, it was a lane in there. Come up on our fourth trap now. Let's see. You get it? Uh -huh. I see one there right there. That's a big one. That's a big one. Oh, there you are. How about that? Down this way, a couple of big ones. Oh, that's a nice one there. Mm -hmm. Look at that guy. There you go. There's your name tag. You have his name tag on your trap. Escape rings. That was lane snapper. All lane snapper, All huh? Lane. Okay, it's trap number five. This 
is a nice one. So what we got? We got three more traps left. So maybe we'll get lucky. Trap six. I hope there's some big ones in there. This one's in about 18 feet of water. Uh, huh? Only three. Yeah, little ones and one nice one. One nice one. That's a that big lane snapper. We recycle our fish. We go fishing and save the heads and all, and we set our crab traps the next day. That's nice. We got number seven now. Four crabs, two little guys we gotta throw back, and a couple nice ones. That one's a nice one there. What kind of meat was that? Piece of albacore. That was albacore also. Yeah. yeah, we're doing all right. We got a couple of nice meals anyway. Yeah. We just like those big ones. There's our last one, number eight. The last hope. This is one of the new traps. Couple nice ones in there. One, two, three, four. Well, we got five in there. One big, one. Good one stuff. nice one. What's that bait? Head. That was the albacore head. Yeah. Still there. Here's what we ended up with. We did pretty good today. There's some nice ones like that one down there, over here, over there. That's a nice sized crab. They're all nice and clean. So we're going back in, we'll take them back and steam them and start picking them. For the, we wet this towel in the river and then cover the crabs up with them. You don't want to put them on ice, it seems like they only die when you put them on ice. Cover them up with a towel or a piece of burlap's better if you got it. But this keeps it, we never any, we haven't had any dye on this, you know. We get back in and we're alive. We got about an hour and a half ride. So we got good luck with, you know, handling them that way. Was he hurt? Is he hurt? I don't know. No, it's just his tail. That's his spot. Huh? You sure he's not hurt? No, he's not hurt. No, not hurt. Well, we did pretty good today. We got some good sized crabs. We had a good day. So now, time to take them home and cook them up. So, if you enjoy our videos, give us a thumbs up and subscribe to our channel. Thanks for watching.